Hey, what's going on guys? It's Risky here. Welcome back to some more American Truck Simulator. It's been quite some time since I've brought this game to the channel. Uh, and actually now I do have a wheel set up. Now I'm using the Logitech G29. I got the little shifter set up. And uh, yeah, we're here in this international cab over truck today. It's a 10 speed. We're going to be shifting through all the gears. And oh, excuse me. I got the hiccups right now. It's freaking terrible. But uh, yeah, we're hauling some ha Home Depot supplies of some sort here. Let's see what we're hauling hauling sorry i got the freaking hiccups this is ridiculous empty pallets to bellingham i have not been to bellingham yet we're up here in washington i think that's the last location i need in washington until i have everything discovered but uh yeah here's the truck we're in a cab over if you guys enjoy these videos make sure to let me know because it's been a while since i've played this game on the channel and uh, i do really enjoy it it's much better with the wheel now uh, if you do hear any noises like me shifting oh god damn if you hear me shifting anything, I am very sorry about that. But let's get going on the road here. And uh, I don't have track IR or anything. That's one of my next upgrades for the setup is uh, track IR. Because that would make looking around and playing and shifting so much easier. But uh, yeah, let's get on this road here today. We're going to be just chilling, talking about some things. Just different content on the channel, man. I'm... I really want to mix it up this year. Oh, gosh. 2020, I really do want to mix it up and not only just base my channel around Call of the Wild because that game does get kind of stale at times. And it's hard to get on a game and record it when you're not really having fun. Uh, but th th there's... Blah, 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 I can't even speak. Oh, gosh. <clears throat> Definitely going to be a bunch of Call of the Wild videos coming still. Don't worry. But... Uh, I'm going to play a little bit of American Truck Simulator as well. But let's turn out of here. And I wish I had Track IR so I could look over that way and see where my trailer is. But we're going to do some driving. Uh, the left lane, huh? Okay. I didn't know it was right there. I need my lights on too. That would probably help. Boom, there we go. This thing it has some beautiful lighting on it. <clears throat> Man, I wish my hiccups would go away. This is terrible. I'm trying to do a commentary and have hiccups at the same time. But yeah, like I said, let me know if you guys want to see more of these. Every time I try and talk, I hiccup. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Do I have a red light or something? I can't see it. <laughs> oh, I do. It's just I'm in a cab over and I can't freaking see it. We're going to be in a third person for a second here until I can see this light. I think we're about to get the green. Yep, there. There we go. Try our best not to stall the truck today. Do any of you guys play American Truck Simulator? If you do, then let me know. This game has been my addiction lately. Ever since I got this new wheel, this is all I've really been playing, minus a little little bit of hunter classic and stuff it's super enjoyable i'm gonna i'm gonna get some track ir that way i can have head tracking and look around without taking my hands off the wheel <clears throat> and i'm gonna get an eaton fuller shifter knob thing that has the range selector splitter and everything on the knob that i can uh, connect to my actual sh shifter itself and man these hiccups better go away Use the left lane. We doing that, lady. But yeah, we're in a 10 speed in international today. I know I've been driving a lot of 10 speeds because with my shifter setup right now, it's really the easiest thing. And once I do get that new Eaton Fuller sh shift knob, it will be much easier to, you know, drive an 18 speed is obviously. <clears throat> So let's get over here. We're just going to be sitting back. This is just such a relaxing game to get on and play. It's super fun to record. It's been a while since I've made a video on this. And when I used to record it, I used to play on the keyboard. And it was just ridiculous trying to play this game with a keyboard. Uh, this is much better. I've been having a ball. Been having an absolute ball playing this. <clears throat> This truck sounds pretty good too. I think we got a, a Cummins in it right now. 
some kind of Cummins. I, f I forgot what I put in it. I know it's a Cummins, though. Pretty dope truck. Let's go ahead and set our cruise control there. 63. We're in a 60 zone there. You can see on the, the mini-map there to the right. The right. So this is your speed. Whew. These freaking hiccups hurt now. Oh, gosh. I'm not paying attention. Looking over at my OBS recording software. I ain't a certified truck driver. I'm a little crazy. Probably should slow down a little bit. This truck's... Oh, gosh. I can't talk, man. I'm so sorry, guys. This is ridiculous. I've had these hiccups for like an hour now. And I was like... I was going to wait until they go away. But uh, it doesn't seem like they're going away. Because I've had them for like an hour. And I have like mild heartburn, heartburn with it. It's terrible. Uh, it's probably that sandwich I had earlier with pepper jack cheese on it. Nightmare. I had a traffic mod on that made the traffic a lot more dense, but it was nice because, as you can see here, there's not a lot of traffic. It was nice, but it kind of brought a little bit too much traffic. Like, the game couldn't really handle it, I guess. Like, the AI. We can bypass the way station, thank goodness. But the I the AI couldn't handle it. Uh, like whenever you would go to merge and stuff, they would end up just crashing into each other. So I had to took that mod out. But I am using quite a few mods. I got uh, road textures, no bar no barriers, so there's no like little X's on the roads that you can't actually go on. Just makes it look a little bit more immersive and realistic. Makes the immersion better. But this truck is sweet, ain't it? Look at those lights on the gauges. It looks super cool. What is this? Speed limit, 60. Okay. And no, we're going about 60. About 65. We can go about 5 over. That's normally what I do in real life when I'm driving. Everybody normally goes about 5 over the speed limit. You can, you can normally get away with that in most most places. <clears throat> we're in Spokane, Washington. I think that's what that sign said back there. Or we're gonna be in Spokane in half a mile. Use the left lane. Um, for these videos, what I'm thinking about doing eventually, eventually is getting a face cam set up on my monitor. That way you guys can actually see me driving and shifting and stuff. I think that would be pretty cool for these videos. And maybe for some of the Call of the Wild videos as well. I don't know how well this video is going to do. Uh, but no matter if this video does very well or not I'm gonna still keep on uploading these videos because it's just something different for the channel because I know there's a good bit of you guys out there that will enjoy these videos um and I know there's a good bit of you that are not interested as well or at all not as well at all we're in the, the city right now I haven't been to a big city like this driving in forever I actually haven't been to these roads at all if you look down there on the map, you can see where it's all gray. It shows you where I haven't been, and all the places that are yellow shows you the ro roads that I've traveled. But this is pretty neat. Oh, we're in Seattle, I guess, right? Seattle Mole? Is that the achievement I got, just got? I just love playing this game whenever I'm not playing anything else and have nothing else to do. It's just so relaxing. I don't normally just turn on Spotify and turn music really low and just sit back and drive it is just something else man imagine this in vr and i just these hiccups are terrible oh oh fuck <laughs> this is real professional of me making a video while i have hiccups i didn't want to but kind of am forced to Uh oh, what's this? Uh oh. Gotta get over? Okay. Well, that sucks. Looks like we gotta make a freaking detour. Great. Okay, well, I'm gonna do this detour, and once we get back on the highway over here, I'm gonna catch up with you guys because this is gonna take forever and my brakes don't work. We're gonna run that stop sign. Jeez, the brakes did not work at all. 
but I'm gonna get back on the highway here because that was bullshit. I had a freaking accident up there or something. In 200 meters. All right, we're getting back on the highway. I took a couple extra minutes that I didn't want to add on because I know these videos are probably gonna be quite a bit longer than my normal Call of the Wild videos. They might be 20, 20 minutes instead of the normal like 10. Are you gonna let me on, brother? Oh, you are. Wow, kind of. Thank you. I gotta get over. Unfortunately, it's nighttime and we can't really see much because I really wanted to be able to see see some things today. We're booking it. I'm gonna go ahead and shift back up in the tent and just let her ride. So what you guys been up to? I, th I like these videos because we can just sit back and chill and talk. You can bypass the way station. Thank you, goodness gracious. I hate having to hit those things. But what you been up to? I ain't been up to much. Just uh, been messing with my my uh, recording room as of lately got a bunch of new equipment coming in here that I've been uh, saving up for and stuff just got me a new chair getting a new desk soon because this desk that I have all my stuff on right now is ter terrible and uh, I gotta get a new monitor soon too I have, I have one monitor now and then I have a second monitor that's just like my old TV that I used to use <laughs> oh gosh and it's just leaning up against like the wall right now it's not even on a stand <laughs> Cause I don't know where the stand stand went, but I gotta get another monitor so I can have a second one. Hold on a minute, brother. You can get over. But uh, yeah, then I have a two monitor set up, and I plan on maybe by the end of January or maybe the beginning of February. We'll see. Uh, I'm gonna do a setup video, a little setup tour, show you guys the. The recording room because it's cha changed quite a bit i think i have about two gaming setup videos on my channel right now i can't remember i know i have one uh and i know the setup over the past like seven years that i've really been uh, seven or eight years that i've really been into gaming hardcore uh it's been incredible how much my setup has changed and improved over that amount of time i'm very happy with the setup right now i just need to Get a few more things in here and it'll be pretty much exactly what I wanted. Use the right lane. Use the right lane. The exit on the right. Okay. Take the exit on the right. Let's see if we can put her down in the eighth. Trying to use the Jake break a little bit. Bellingham, all right. Use the left lane, then turn left. Beautiful. We're almost to our destination today. Turn left. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to see that red light. I gotta park right here because I got this freaking visor on, and I can't see with it. Hold on, I gotta go to this. There we go. You can do some skipping of gears. I don't really need to use every single gear every time. I can't wait to start using 18s speed though with the new shift knob that I'm gonna get I must park right here oh we stalled her whoops I can drive a stick in real life my truck in real life is a stick shift but I'm just confusing the shit out of myself right now 
Man, I can't wait to get track AR too. It's gonna be so much easier to look around, shift, and do everything at the same time. Like right now, it's so complicated. Turn right. And uh, use our mouse here a little bit. We can go right on red. Made that turn pretty good. Almost to our destination, I'm pretty sure. We can hit this button here. Yep, we're pretty close. One mile away. Which one mile in this game is like 500 yards real life. <laughs> We're getting there. Oh, I, keep, I keep forgetting that we're in like a tw 25 zone and I'm just ripping gears and everything. Just a ha Turn haul on it. Man, I've, I've been recording for, what is this, 20 minutes now? And I've had the hiccups this whole entire time. Turn right. I love this G29 though. Force feedback. It's great. I've wanted one of these things for a long time and I finally got my hands on one and I love it. Makes driving games so much more fun. In 200 meters, turn left. We're almost here. There's our, our stop right there. Turn left. You have arrived. All right. We're going to attempt to back her in. All right, Blinker, you can shut up now. Where do you need it? So we got to go up to the right. Let's see if we can do this. All right, there's our spot right there. So what should we do? I think we're going to go ahead and put her down in like third. Third, gosh, these hiccups, man. Oh, see what we can do here. Let's uh, go third per person real quick and see. Okay, I think I have an idea of what we can do. We can go like this. Kind of just back her straight in there. I don't want to hit anybody's trailer over there or anything. It's kind of hard to see. Can't really lean forward and look at my mirrors really closely because I've got a microphone in front of my face today. All right. So we can bring her on around. I can't really see exactly where we are. Oh, are we going to hit that trailer? Oh, no, we're good. We're going to have to do a little pull-up strategy. But we almost got it. You know what? We might not need to pull up. Oh, I think that's good. We got it. Basically, first try. Eh, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull up a little bit. I want to straighten her out a little bit more, cause that was a little bit too cockeyed for me. All right, getting it. All righty. Put our e or our parking brake on. And we made it here safely, folks. No crashes, no accidents, nothing like that. And let's go ahead and decouple that. And that is going to be our run here today in the cab over. Beautiful. We got excellent, excelente. We drove almost 200 miles. Took four hours in game time. It took about, we've been recording for 22 minutes now. Not bad at all. So, uh, yeah, very good. Thank you guys so much for watching. Definitely stay tuned for more. Um, American Truck Simulator because that was loads of fun. It's so much more fun with the wheel. I think once I get like a face cam, 
um, the head tracking thing and a new shift knob it's going to be so much more fun to play these games so let me know if you want to see more if you want to see me use any specific trucks or anything like that if you want to see me go to any specific places because i'll definitely do it so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one later